Cadet's log. Last week was a really hard one, but I feel my crew's performance is beginning to improve. Corn. Corn. Hi, David. What's up? Weren't you supposed to be studying the NAB Sims tonight? I studied a couple hours and I needed to take a break. Your scores in the simulator haven't improved that much. We've been through this. And we'll keep going through it until you deliver what you're capable of. Okay, what do you want me to do? I want you to study NAV protocols for three hours before our next mission. Corn, what's wrong? Look, it's like this. If I don't try hard, it doesn't matter if I fail. But if I study hard and I still don't make it... What about the rest of us? You know, we're doing our best. And we're getting nothing from you. Look, David. I can't guarantee anything, but I'll try. Good. <sighs> Cadet's log, supplemental. Not my best moment as a commanding officer. The actions of the Venturi Raiders are not popular with the majority of the people on Venturi home. Several Venturi diplomats are aboard the USS LaGrange. You will escort the LaGrange to Omega-12-300, which the diplomats report is the headquarters for the Venturi Raiding Force. There, they will attempt to negotiate a settlement. There is a problem. Omega-12-300 is beyond the galactic barrier, a mysterious energy field that encompasses the known galaxy. You will have to penetrate the barrier in order to reach the Venturi. This is an extremely dangerous area that's known to have dangerous side effects on some of the people traveling through it. So be careful. Captain's Log, Stardate 3221.6. We are scheduled to escort the USS LaGrange to the Venturi stronghold outside the galactic barrier in order to negotiate a settlement to the Venturi crisis. Captain, three Venturi ships just came out of war. They are coming at us on an attack vector. Correction, they are attacking the Star Trek. Drives are fit as a fiddle now, Captain. Port side shields repaired. Lower shields have been hit. Port side shields have been hit. Port side shields repaired. Lower shields.
Lower shields online. All Venturi ships have been destroyed or disabled, Captain. Starbase 23 is secure. But we lost the Lagrange. Captain, an instant before the Lagrange was destroyed, I sensed something. It was as if I was in a mine meld with someone who was experiencing a sharp pain. You think there were Vulcans on the Lagrange? There were no Vulcans or individuals with known psi talents aboard the Lagrange. What I sensed seemed like it originated far away, farther than my mind could comprehend. It was a mind of great power. Incoming message from Starfleet, Captain. Let's hear it. With the destruction of the Lagrange, our peace mission is over. However, we do know the location of the Venturi base. Your new orders are to proceed to Omega-12-300 and reconnoiter the Venturi forces. We need accurate intelligence on Venturi capabilities. Starfleet out. Course laid in, Captain. Lower shields repaired. Phasers are online again, ready to fire on your orders. We've completed repairs on the tractor beam, sir. Phasers are operational again, Captain. The matter-antimatter -matter balance is stable again, Captain. You can go to warp at any time. Barrier in 10 seconds. All hands brace for impact. Medical team, stand by. Phasers are unavailable. Entering Omega 12 300 system. To complete our mission, we should scan the Venturi base. Um. Captain, we have a malfunction in the warp field generator. 
We have full power in the warp engines, but no way to use our warp drive. Captain, Prelate Alshoff is hailing us. He's forcing his transmission on screen. This is quite a pilgrimage you've made, Captain. Perhaps now we can clear up the misunderstandings that have plagued our relationship. Now, why have you been attacking my followers? I'd like to know more about who you are. Many people have problems with the actions of your followers. Are you willing to answer for them? I'd like to know more about who you are. Twelve billion years ago, God created the universe in a fiery explosion and spread it over the vast vacuum of space. He created many wonders, but even he couldn't create appreciation of these wonders without sentience. So he created us, but life was still too small, too limited in its viewpoint to truly understand creation. Thus, he created the barrier by which sentients could expand their minds and commune with the very nature of the universe. I am the first, Captain. The first being to commune with God in all his glory and to keep his mind intact. All hail Alshaf, the true and final voice of God. I'm not here to be a theologian, Alshaf. Do you want peace with the Federation or not? I believe in you, Alshaf. I believe in you, Alshaf. You mock me. I know all there is to know about you and your mission. But my blood shall not flow today. There is a small base entrenched in the surface of the planetoid. They have a small fusion reactor, a transporter system, and a sensor array. I find no evidence of defensive systems or communications. There are approximately 32 life forms within the complex. All are Venturi. Mission objective complete. Captain, this vessel appears to be an alien derelict predating the Federation. From the rate of atomic decay within the ship's hull, I would guess that this vessel is over 70,000 years old. The Venturi renegades must have found these ships and restored them. It's no wonder no one's ever seen them before. The Venturi cruiser's power readings far exceed its engine capacity. It is logical, given what we have seen of Alshaf's psychokinetic powers, to assume that Alshaf himself is using his abilities to boost the power of the ship.
Life support has been hit. Star Port side shields have been hit. Forward sh starboard shields have been hit. Starboard shield. Lower shields have been hit. Forward shields have been hit. Life support system offline. Upper shields have been hit. Forward shields have been hit. Forward shields repaired. Upper shields have been hit. Upper shields repaired. Upper shields down to 50%. Upper shields online. Upper shields online. Lower shields repaired. Upper shields repaired. as before. Forward shields online. Starboard shields have been hit. Starboard shields repaired. Phasers are online again, ready to fire on your orders. Forward shields repaired. We got our engines back online, Captain. You can take her into warp any time now. of life support left. No response, Captain. No response, Captain. No response, Captain. No response, Captain. Hailing frequency open. Everything is going fine. Forrester out. We've completed repairs on the tractor beam, sir.
Phases are online again, ready to fire on your orders. Life support has been hit! What? That shield system is damaged. The aircraft's working on it. Forward shields have been hit. Forward shields repaired. Forward shields have been hit. Forward shields. Lower shields have been hit. Forward shields repaired. Starboard shields have been hit. Lower shields have been hit. Lower, sh lower shields have been hit. Your missions are critical! Star star starboard shields have been hit. Starboard shields repaired. Phasers are critical! Upper shields have been hit! Upper shields on- The impulse engines are at critical, Captain! Upper shields online. Upper shields on- Sense- Upper shields have been hit! Upper shields have been hit! Upper shields- Starboard shields have been hit! Upper shields have been hit! Reports of casualties on decks 20 through 22, sir. Lower shields repaired. Port side shields repaired. Starboard shields with reports of casualties on deck 3 through 9, sir. All integrity down to 50%. Starboard shields with impulse engines are critical. Heavy casualties on all. Captain, whatever prevented us from going to warp is gone. Al Shaf is gone. He must have had extraordinary power. Course laid in, Captain. Captain, the warp drive is not online. Upper shields repaired. Life support system online. No response, Captain. No response, Captain. No response, Captain. Phasers are online again, ready to fire on your orders.
The warp drives are fit as a fiddle now, Captain. Galactic barrier in 10 seconds. All hands brace for impact. Medical team, stand by. Hailing frequency open. Everything is going fine. Forrester out. Mission accomplished, Starfleet. I have a special commendation for you. While at Omega-12-300, you scanned the derelict vessels that the Venturi are using as their craft. We now know much more about the origin of the technology that the Venturi are using. That was good thinking on your part. Congratulations on making it through a difficult series. We should also like to extend our special thanks to Sturek for helping us act out the psychic powers of Alshaf in that scenario. The death of Alshaf brings an end to the main raiding force of the Venturi. You may have noticed as the scenarios progressed, the raiders became less communicative. That was no coincidence. Alshaf's mental control over his followers was increasing as time went on. It is possible that you will see Venturi Raiders again. Not all of the Raiders needed to be coerced to help their leader. Until then, you are dismissed. <laughs>